Hello, hello, Scorpio, Sagittarius, Cusp, Cross Watchers. Hi, everyone. Welcome to my channel. I am Tiarka Love. How are you all doing? All right, Scorpio, Sagittarius, Cusp. It's time for me to get you all some messages for the month of October. Yay! Please know that these will be general. <laughs> Please know that these will be general messages. They may or may not resonate with all of you beautiful individuals, okay? If you find these messages here uh, resonate, please feel free to take them with you. If you find that these messages messages does not resonate with you at all, then just please do leave them here on the table to allow someone to pick them up that they will resonate with, okay? All right, so if you all um, are active on... TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, and you would like to go check me out on my other social media platforms, feel free to go down to that description box below, click on the links, and it will send you um, to your designated area or location, okay? Also, if you all are new here, again, welcome. I really hope you're going to find some messages here that will be helpful. If you all are returning welcome back you all thank you to everyone that has previously liked subscribed shared commented or even watched i greatly appreciate it okay all right y'all so let's get started scorpio sagittarius cusp situation here for some of you all you could be dealing with a capricorn for others of you all there are some type of addictions here um some temptation someone falling victim uh to temptation certain te temptations okay could be needing to get things um could be dealing with some type of um things you know in regards to sexuality as well okay well let's see how you feel about these addictions about this capricorn maybe for some of you all about these temptations this is causing some conflict here okay for some you could be dealing with the leo for others of you all there's a lot of conflict here between you and this person this is causing there be this is causing there to be a lot of struggle here okay what are some obstacles or stagnations here for some you could be dealing with the pisces for others of you all um you got to kind of take a pause here gather up a new perspective you kind of got to th see things from a different perspective become more enlightened okay in the recent past for some you could have been dealing with the leo for others of you all you are very powerful um had this assertive take charge attitude here okay and yeah all right so when it comes to your hopes you are hoping for some of you all for scorpio for others of you all you are hoping for some things to come to an end therefore there could be new beginnings you are hoping to be open for transformation or that hoping that this connection um kind of um transform into something better okay so let's see who or what is coming towards you all for some of you all could be an aries for others of you all this is a divine intervention some um not mass destruction some a type of um Something is shaking the foundation of uh, your your foundation, okay? So, there are going to be some sudden changes that is coming towards you all. Let's see how you're viewing yourself, okay? So, you do want to stand up for what you believe in. You do see yourself as you just want honesty. You want truth here. Um, and you do want maybe a person to deal with some type of consequences or um, you're just trying to balance out you know um your karma okay for some all right who or what let's see potential outcome or who or what is who or what are you moving towards for some it could be a sagittarius for others of you all you're gonna be moving towards someone who is guarded here um this could be a wounded warrior someone who has a lot of boundaries around their heart um someone who has a hard time opening up emotionally or this is what you're moving towards you okay all right so let's keep going let's look more into the situation in the situation here you got this law of attraction you got to know that we attract what we are you got to use the law of attraction to manifest your perfect match by being the perfect match to yourself okay so how you feeling about that clarifying this five of wands um children are a significant factor in your love life this may signify the desire to have children or someone's inner child and inner child needing some attention okay 
All right. So let's look more into the stagnations here. This warm embrace. Okay. So you got to let yourself enjoy your partner's loving arms around your body. Their touch ignites a flame within. Stagnations here is you're not getting this warm embrace or feeling this warm embrace coming from your person. Okay. In the recent past here, you felt like you were very clear about what you wanted. All right. Um, you, yeah, you were very assertive. You, you were. It's like very soon you were kind of expecting things to kind of change in a blink of an eye, okay? So let's look more into your hopes here, Scorpio, Sagittarius, because you are hope. And when it comes to your hopes, you got to, the support of family and friends may help strengthen your connection. So maybe lean on your family or friends if you need this extra support or, um, yeah, as you go through this transformation, okay? So let's tell me more about this tower. All right, who or what is coming towards you all? You got to be patient, all right? So why the rush? There's no need to rush divine timing. Enjoy the journey because it will be worth it in the end, all right? You do see yourself as you feel like um, you and this person is telepathic. Uh, connected telepathically connected here you want to make sure you to pay attention to the telepathic messages that you are being sent and received at this time um, about the situation okay so let's see who or what is coming who or what are you moving towards you all are moving towards playfulness here knowing that playtime is essential for relationships you got to have a little fun recapturing romance with your partner okay so uh, let's get you all some more messages Let's look more into um, this connection between you and your person. Scorpio Sagittarius Cusp. Tell us more about this connection for the month of October. All right. It looks like um, you all are planning here. Or there could be a period of waiting. Okay. For some of you all, you could be meeting someone new. All right. Um, okay. We got in this connection here. Someone is really focused focused on their money here. You do feel this spiritual connection with this person. Got the twin flame with the telepath, uh, telepathy. So there is a spiritual connection here between you and this person. Okay. That could be soon. You all could be spending some quality time with each other soon. Okay. It's like um, you two going to be working on that gaining each other's trust here okay you're going to be learning a spiritual lesson as well for some you just could be meeting someone new okay if you are meeting someone new you are going to be spending a lot of quality time together um you're going to feel like you two are spiritually connected to each other okay this person is going to be more open um to maybe gaining your trust okay or wanting to gain your trust or Wanting you to gain their trust or wanting trust here, okay? There's going to be a lot of passion and there could be um, some a lot of passion at night here. Let's see. Scorpio Sagittarius Cusp. All right. So, if okay, we got these arguments, okay? Um, there's a lot of rumors. There's some arguments going on. You and this person could be arguing. There's a lot of rumors going around about you and your love interest. You could be dealing with a childhood love or someone who is maybe immature. The maturity level isn't. You two are not on the same level when it comes to maturity here. All right. Someone is contemplating. All right. They don't know whether or not they should stay or should they go. But it's like. It's like both of you all know that there are these, these feelings that you feel are mutual. It's just, um, it's just right now, uh, I don't know if it's the mask is on. Things are not quite what they seem. So I don't know. Y'all let me know in the comments what is going on between you and this person. Okay. Okay. But let me, um, let's see. How's your person feeling? Scorpio Sagittarius, cuz how's your person feeling about this connection? Time spent in solitude has given them a chance to get to know themselves more or get to know themselves better to be able to set a more solid foundation. Okay. Also, um, this person entered your life to test you, teach you, and to bring out the very best in you. Now their part in your story is over. Your person is going through a healing cycle or they are at the end of a big healing cycle, coming to peace with their past and bringing back balance into this connection. Okay. All right. So let me get you all a healing message. 
I don't know what's up with these messages for the month of October. Let's get you all a healing message. All right. So there is some type of a deception here. Okay, so someone or something is not quite what it seems. Your perception or of this person or situation could be off track or things are deliberately being hidden. Okay, you do want to focus on your career in the month of October. So, um, yeah, focus on your career. And I don't know why these keep coming out. All right, but you got this young man here. This is someone who is outgoing, uh, friendly, and a natural leader. He is very expressive, loves creating and prefers meaningful conversation over chit chat. I don't know if you got to meet this person through work. For some of you all, with someone new, you could be meeting um, someone new uh, through work with this career being here. Or um, this could be maybe your person, all right, um, that needs to be honest, okay? Or your perception of the person is, is a bit off track, okay? All right, so Scorpio Sagittarius, because these are your messages for the month of October. I really hope that they will be helpful. Thank you all so much for joining me. I um, am sending you all so much love, light, and positivity. Y'all don't know what's wrong. <laughs> but I will uh, thank you all for your likes, comments, subscribe, shares. I greatly appreciate it. I will see you all in the next video. Bye.